to the mountains to visit Boyana Church and Rila Monastery. Let's go. We're here at Boyana Church. This is Boyana Church, so this part was built in the 9th century, the middle part the 13th century, and the newest part was the 19th century. Doesn't look very impressive from the outside, but apparently there's beautiful frescoes inside. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to film inside, so we might just have to Google the photos. Even though the church is from the 13th century, they actually used marble and stone from like the 1st to the 4th century from the Roman times that used to be here. Got our names translated into the Cyrillic alphabet. Learning one letter changed to mine, but Christopher looks cross. You can see stork nests in the roof. And now we're heading into the mountains to Rila Monastery. We've made it to Rila Monastery. We're in the yard right now. It's very quiet. <laughs> so we're gonna take a look around and see it. It's actually a working monastery still. So it's an Orthodox monks. So it's an all male monastery. This monastery was established in 927, so it's over a thousand years old now. And it's starting to rain on us, um, but it's up in the Rila Mountains. It's about 1,200 meters high. So really beautiful. You can see the frescoes behind me.
above on the balconies there. You can actually stay here, which is pretty cool. I think the rooms are quite basic, but it would be an experience to stay here. This is the scene of the Virgin Mary in the Oshery, I think it's called. It used to be like their church attached to the monastery. I found a monastery cat. Hey kitty kitty. <laughs> He's ignoring me now that I've taken the camera out. <laughs> I'm all about the monastery cats. He's having his snooze. Mom Kitsa from the monastery's bakery that was opened in 1866. They sell local honey here at the monastery. Apparently it's meant to be really tasty. Oh, Oh, la di oh, oh, la di oh, sip, sip, oh, la di oh.